Hello, welcome back to AJM Learn. Today, I'm going to show you how to change the logo on one page of your site or remove the logo on one page of your site. So we'll start with changing it. Um, the first thing you need to do is go over to your website tools, custom CSS, and upload the file that you want to change it to. I've already done that. You would just click this plus sign, find the other logo that you want to change it to. Um, I have mine here. Once you do that, you click on it, and then you'll see the URL pop here into uh, this panel. Just copy that, and I'm going to remove it. You don't actually want to leave it here. Go back to the site. All right, I'm going to pop over to my example page. So this is an example of when I would want to change it. So white logo looks great here on a hero image. Not so great on a site or a page where I don't have a hero image or maybe a lighter hero image. So you're going to go into the gear, go into advanced, and you're actually going to put this in the page header code injection. Um, I'm just going to put my URL to the side really quick because I need to copy and paste twice. I'm copying the code straight from my post. All right, so there's the code. And then you're actually going to take this URL, remove it. I have it on my pasteboard. And you want to paste it. You could, of course, paste it somewhere else. This just made the most sense for what I'm doing. And you want to paste it between the quote marks here. Click save, and then you will see the new logo here. Everywhere else, it'll still remain, you know, as the original, but it'll only populate on that one page. Now, the next thing I want to show you how to do, super simple, is how to remove the logo on one page. So let's say, for example, here on the home page, let's say you have a client who wants the logo just like really large here in the center of the hero image would be crazy to have it repeated twice. So for this one, you're actually gonna do it within the CSS panel. So go over back to website tools, custom CSS. So paste this in, nothing's gonna happen because we need this collection ID. Um, I have lots of posts. I'll make a note about it in this post about how to find your collection IDs. I use a um, Google extension. I'm gonna click that now, it finds it for you. You can of course right click and inspect with that like why. It takes way more time. Um, so I'm going to grab that collection. That's basically what that's doing is saying this page. Only do it on this page, and you'll see it removed. You would, of course, save it at that point, and that's it. Super simple. Hope you enjoy.